Hi, this is Adam Sweet from Sweet Music Studio. Today I want to talk to you briefly about uh, Mando Cello. I offer Mando Cello lessons here out of my house in Granby, Mass. And if you want to learn Mando Cello, it's actually a fairly straightforward instrument. Tuned in fifths, just like the mandolin, but it has a lower C, uh, like a mandola. It's actually an octave lower than a mandola. So if you already play mandola, um, it won't be very difficult for you to transfer um, what you know about the mandola to this instrument. I'd say the primary difference between the mandocello and the mandola is its size. Um, as you can see, it's quite large, about the size of a, gut of a guitar, maybe slightly smaller. Um, and because it's tuned in fifths, the um, uh, fingering and the scale patterns are very similar to a mandolin um, and a mandola. Um, the mandocello is a, an important uh, function uh, functional instrument of the uh, typical mandolin orchestra. Uh, without the mandocello, there just couldn't be uh, a, uh, a full mando uh, orchestra. Um, the, the primary instruments, of course, of the mandolin orchestra uh, are the mandolins, but because um, much of the music that is performed in a mandolin orchestra has been composed for uh, mandolins, mandolas, and mandocellos, then you're going to really want to have uh, the mandocello instrument itself. Now I've seen mandolin orchestras where they have uh, cellos or even guitars in, in place of uh, mandocellos, but there really isn't any need to do that because the instrument itself is a very straightforward instrument uh, to learn how to play. Um, if, like I said, if you already play mandolin, it's not a very uh, difficult uh, transition from the mandolin to the mandocello. <clears throat> I teach mandocello. I teach it here out of my home in Granby, but I also teach it online using Skype and Google Hangouts. If you want to learn how to play the mandocello, please contact me through my website, sweetmusicstudio.net. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope you have a great day.